what is going on guys barber cvo in the building baby we're on our way to harley davidson savannah to do the demo rides with uh my boy rob here big rob and also wood jr is gonna meet us over there also with also from rider savannah so here we go baby we're about to get it on right now about to get it on Great weather here on a Sunday. Gorgeous, gorgeous weather. A little windy, but it's okay. You know what I mean? Uh, when you ride through the wind, it actually, it cuts through. So we're on our way to Savannah right now. Check out the new 2022 models for a little bit. He decided to bring out a Blaze today blaze is out awesome 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 straightaways right here in uh, in Georgia you can just let it rip see that so what have you guys been up to comment down below let me know what your plans are for 2022 uh, my next meet and greet will be in Myrtle Beach coming up um, I will be trying to head to Sturgis this year it all depends because you know i just opened up my new business and it's been taken off and i've been super super busy with um with the barbershop and and i apologize for not posting as much videos as i have been like i said i had to get on my on my booty with this new business and uh you know be there you know and uh make sure to take care of the clients but like I said, I will be back now doing videos. The, the business is little by little getting, you know, run by itself. I am remodeling with all new um, chairs, stations, you know, all new lighting in the barbershop. So if you're in the area of Savannah, swing by the Barber Post 504 US 80 West in Pooler, Georgia. <laughs> Excuse me. So, what else? Um, Myrtle Beach. I will be at Myrtle Beach. Myrtle Beach will be also there on the list. Uh, oh, I think I said that. Um, what is the other one? Uh, Laconia. Laconia. Um, I think I'm actually going to make it to Laconia. I'm gonna ride over there. I'm not trailering. I don't have a truck no more, so I got a car. So I will be riding to Laconia. That should be fun. I like going to Laconia. They have really nice places to go to. Um, beautiful, beautiful area. The weather should be spectacular at that time. Last time I went with Psycho Fanatics and uh, Glenn, it was amazing weather, really hot. No rain, it was good. Alrighty. What else, what else, what else? I plan on going to um, Atlanta on the bike. I don't know when yet. Should be soon. As soon as the weather kicks in a little, little hotter, I will definitely go to Atlanta. We could probably do a meet and greet over there as well. Um, check out Everyday Faye. Shark Chronicles. Definitely uh, want to meet them out there. I couldn't make it last time. So I'll definitely make it this time. 
Love those chrome works, baby. Guys, I will be doing a, 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 another video on the review on the Danny Gray seat. Should be coming out pretty soon. Tune into that. That was my trip to Daytona and back. All right, guys. I'll see you over there at Harley. Look at these roads, man. Oh, man. Just beautiful. You can just rip it. Awesome, awesome roads. These are actually the back roads um, heading from Pooler all the way to Savannah Harley-Davidson. ever have the chance to put a cam in your bike do so it's worth every single penny every single penny it's probably one of the best things I've ever done on my bike other than the shocks shocks are, are, are definitely a, a big thing on these bikes I have Olin's with the reservoirs and they just feel amazing Rob has Wilbur suspension on his all his bikes with uh, he has also tap performance on his uh, all his bikes I have Chromeworks I'm more of a guy that likes a deeper sound if you like deep sound Chromeworks is your thing if you like like Rawr, like a just crazy crazy uh sound then you go with the the zombie baffles over there and tap performance but my thing is chrome works i love them they sound great i got the aggressor headers on there also as well Woo, this wind is is hey, you're riding normal and then all of a sudden boom you get like a gust of wind and just moves you over. I love these back rows, man. This is awesome. It's like I was in um, Laconia. Laconia, you have actually roads like this. Pretty cool. All right, we're about to be approaching Harley Davidson. Today, yesterday and today was a demo day. So they have all their bikes right here is demoing. Pretty cool. We're gonna check it out in the back over here, see what they got. Check it out. We got Rob doing his U-turn situation.
guys. We are waiting here. Uh, we have to wait at least one hour so that we could do the ride. Um, still a little windy. Check it out. Um, Wood Jr. just uh, popped up right now. We're all going to go on a ride. He's doing in the, the Rogue Glide CVO Limited. I'm doing the Pan America. I don't know exactly which one Rob's doing, but we're, uh, we're going to check it out. All right, so a few more minutes and then we'll be on the road for the road test. Here we got the Street Glide Limited. Really nice color. Awesome. Then this is the Road Glide ST. This is the new bad boy. color is very nice actually very very nice really cool colors and then you got another rogue line limited not a fan of that green not a fan then you got the harley truck and america will be driving over there riding over there and uh wood jr is gonna be riding now all right all right so i invited also he came here with this girl right here <laughs> she's getting ready to get on also signing up right there and look at the bikes they all just arrived right now yeah. they're about to get in right now robert right there doing his video and uh man the sun is beaming isn't it today <laughs> Beaming, beaming. You have a bike in, uh, that's your favorite that you like? That blue one right there. I don't know what it is, but it is. Like a Sportster. That's a Sportster. Yeah, the new one. Of course, I like that. <laughs> that, that is a nice color, though. That is a nice color. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. You tell me. Nice color that one. It is. Yeah. All right. So these are all the 2022 models. They just arrived. This is a sportster that she was talking about. The color is great. There's the fleet right there. There's the fleet. Wood Jr. just arrived. Yo, Wood. Look at this. What do you think about this uh, yellow one right there? Yellow. Wood in the building. Yeah, that's going to be a... That's going to be a... You layer down. You layer down, right? Yeah, lay it down. What's up, y'all? <laughs> yeah, this is a super... You know this reminds me of? The movie Rocky, back in the day, he had a motorcycle oh. that was red and black. I mean, uh, yellow and black. I mean, I see what they were trying to do, but I'm just not impressed, man. No, it's okay. It's not, um, it's okay. I don't want it, uh, uh, it looks ugly in videos, on. but in videos, looks, I mean, in person, it looks okay. Yeah. I'm not a fan of the yellow, me, you know, me. Bumblebee. Now, I do like the, you know what I'm saying, the flakes, but mm -hmm. you got uh, Bruce Rosemeyer? Bumble for 60 grand. Oh. Yeah. But, no, this is the one I'm going to be getting, man. Which one? Which one? Which one? Let's sign the paperwork. <laughs> well, I got to test it out first. And, uh, you know, that's what happened with my CVO, right? Really? I went to one of these. I was going to, uh, just just for the fun, <laughs> what are you doing? Uh-huh. Walked out with that CVO. Did you really? I swear to God. Wow. See, so see. was it the salesman or you just kind of knew all No, that? I just, I just test drove it and I was like. I think I like this. <laughs> See, that's what I'm talking about, man. <laughs> but, yeah, that's what I want to get from me and wifey. And then I'll keep equal, you know what I'm saying? Oh, it's a second bike, too. not a trader. Oh, gosh, yeah, it's a second bike, man. What? I'm not getting rid of equal, man. Oh, no. 
Yo, Eagle is my girl, man. We've been disturbed <laughs> together. We did two of the Iron Butt Association challenges together. Oh, yeah. Yep. So, oh, I might as well break the news to you, then. Yeah, well. I'm about to do the third one, man. No. But this time, this is going to be the uh, 1500. 1500? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, so. Oh, that's tough. All right, we're about to go on the ride. All right, man. All right. There's, the trail has been pretty clear all day. It is getting a little windy out there, so be prepared for maybe some side gusts. We have to get on the ground a little bit. If it gets too bad, I might call for us to go single file. If I do, just move yourself in the center of the lane so that we got a little more play left and right if we do get hit. Okay? All right, guys. We are jumping right now live on the first time on a Pan America unbelievable i am a little nervous i am going on my tippy toes with this so it's gonna be a new adventure for me you know I me mean? i always wanted to try this i always wanted to check it out and uh see how it goes a little nervous but here we go oh my god i can't get up i'm five eight and this is definitely a little different Oh my god, how do you even turn this on? I have no idea how to turn this on. Oh, the bike lowered as soon as you turned it on. The bike lowered once you turned it on. All right, let's. Oh man. No pipe whatsoever. Now the clutch is very different than mine because you see mine, you see how I have to let it go like really far like over here to start it. Mine, it goes right there and it's already going. <clears throat> oh, let me check my foot controls, the neutral. Oh, here it is. So this is uh, one two neutral in the middle that's a neutral there it goes also this is fun this is definitely fun this thing feels like a toy Look at wood, baby. Wood Junior, baby, let's go. <laughs> oh man, he looks so good in that bike. He looks fantastic. That's actually his next purchase he wants to do, so we're gonna Go with there. So let me tell you a little story real quick. When we did a um, when we did a, the, a, a test ride in Pennsylvania for my 2019 Streetlight CVO, I did a test run just like this, and it wound up being that I was like, "Babe, what do you think? Do you like it?" She's like, "Sure, it feels good." And guess what? We walked right out with it, and we bought it right after the test ride. Look at that. So there's a lot of buttons on here right now that I don't even know how to use it. Um, it would take a little time, so I can't really explain to you what this is. See Pan America right here. Feels good. I didn't even know how to start it, so feels good. Like I said, when I sat down, I, I turned on the bike and it lowered right away. It lowered the suspension probably like at least an inch at least an inch wood yeah what's up what yeah 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 he looks good man he definitely looks good
All right, so here we go. So this is actually like the footings from like if you are if you're riding a, a sports bike, your foot position is almost exactly the same. Like your knees are almost bent. This is awesome. This is awesome. It feels so nice. It feels very smooth. I mean, I don't know if I would go long distance with this. I don't know. That's something that I would have to, like, get used to. What's up? You have to adjust it. You have to adjust it. Back. <laughs> so he's adjust the, the <laughs> So he <laughs> hey, do I look like I got money? You look good, you look good. That's all okay. get a number one after this. Your bank account looks full. Oh yeah? Yeah. <laughs> oh man. He looks great. It's missing one of the hand guards over here. I think it broke off. I don't know what happened. I think this is adjustable. Let me see. I think. I don't know. I can't mess with that right now. I should have done it before. Wow, the pickup on this is crazy. Can you imagine if this thing was like electric? That would have been great. Ooh. This thing feels like a toy. <laughs> now I know what all the fuss is about. Oh, we're kicking it. We're kicking it. We're going about 60 miles an hour. The wind buffeting is actually not bad. This windshield definitely helps out for sure. It's just, I don't know how it would feel if I go on like if your back would hurt after a while because there's really no back support unless you put like a bag here in the back you're kind of slouching down a little bit forward well i don't know i have short arms so let's see how it would go this ride is only 25 minutes i'm not going to keep you here for all 25 minutes but you know We'll, uh, we'll fast forward the ride. Let me see the lean angle. Hold on. Leaning. Leaning. Oh, the brake is crazy. Does this have back brakes? Oh, yes, it does. Man, the foot controls are a little different. Definitely a little different. Pretty cool nice and fun all right so we're just gonna fast forward the ride and we'll go from there I'm gonna do some quick U-turns real quick. Head and eyes, head and eyes, head and eyes, head and eyes. Head and eyes. Wow, this is so much easier to do a U-turn on this thing. This thing is awesome. Pretty good. I like it. 
Head and eyes. Head and eyes. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Who? I don't know. Whoever. Oh, the down. girl with wood. Oh. Okay. Yeah. <laughs>